Well, we, we started coaching Nick at least six, five, six years ago when he had a different partner. And back then he showed a lot of um, potential to be a good ice dancer. Yeah. Haley only came to us two years ago uh, through singles. She was a top level Canadian single skater and she was trying to make the switch to ice dance. You know, I moved to Vancouver to train when I was 15. So two years of just kind of searching and learning how to ice dance on my own. And the third year I found Nick and it was such a blessing. They're the type of team when it, they walk into the building, they're a stunning couple. They're both very good looking, they're tall, they're lean. They have the it look factor. Haley's definitely the performance. She's definitely like the energy and the, just the talent almost yeah, in that aspect. And just, I don't think I'd be able to do it without her almost. <laughs> it's probably one of the most satisfying feelings ever. I think having someone out there skating with me, Nick, is so comforting. I, I love being able to have somebody there for me. The wisdom, the brains, the strength of the team, he carries it. And yeah, we, ve we definitely contrast each other. If they, if they can keep up what they've shown me this spring and keep going on their path that they're on right now, can keep that up over the next couple of years, the sky's the limit. I don't even know what I would say if I knew I was going to the Olympics. Yeah, that would be... <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> yeah. Be good at your skating, but be good in every single aspect of your life because... It all comes down. It all comes yeah. down to exactly. how you carry yourself through life. Uh, but especially if you go to the Olympics, all yeah. the eyes are going to be on you, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs>